Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting rain to episode 3 of season 2 of Cells at Work. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. BTW, I'm sorry that this and the other three shows that I have to watch today um, are really later on tonight are coming out. A lot of things happened earlier yesterday, but oh god, that's loud. Well, hey, at least he's patient, unlike the one from Code Black. Jesus. Hmm? Metal. Oh. Who gonna eat their sandwich after that? Mm -hmm. Ah, my blood cell. <laughs> oh. Uh. She would do that. She would do that. I mean. <laughs> Oh, Jesus God, she mm. I love her so much, precious baby. Come here, puppy. Dengue fever? Well, okay, it's a fever, but I don't, um, I've never heard of that type of fever before. Oh, Jesus Christ. seen you before.
that a mosquito? <laughs> yeah, mosquito. Yeah, because eventually you're going to get, you know, your red blood cells are going to go bye-bye. Yep, yep, mm-hmm. There they go. Are the platelets right? <laughs> hmm? Oh, it's done taking blood. Or unless the human killed it. Is that also supposed to be an Easter egg to JoJo? Because that felt like a JoJo Easter egg. Forever. Dead end. Oh my god. There's so many. You have to, it's an emergency. No! Oh, poor thing. Uh. Holy crap, man. There's too many of them. Oh. But wait, what what about the real one though? I mean, wouldn't we shouldn't we have like found the real one first even though that technically would have been a needle in a haystack, but hey, you know, you do what you do. God damn, we're going to clean all that up. I mean, yeah, platelets can do that, them little kids.
cars. forever yeah it could have been worse red blood cells she's always going to be tangled in this situation you never know what's going to happen in a day in her life Aww. yeah but it's okay Sorry for that. <laughs> ah, yes, acne. My least favorite thing. Oh, God, I hate those two. Like, freaking ingrown hairs. Oh, my God. Are the worst things. Oh, he's so cute. Oh. Oh, thank God. I don't think I could watch a little kid get, you know, lashes. They look so disgusting. Seriously, this show make me feel some type of way whenever we see like a germ, but like, mm. oh!
Jesus. Uh. See, it also makes you wonder, especially like when you eat something that's fried or anything sweet um, and such. Because, of course, like when you eat something that's fried foods or something sweet, you're getting, you know, acne from that. Also, when you touch your face a lot because the dirt on your hands and things like that. But it also makes you wonder, like, what else causes acne? It's also like sometimes a gene thing. Oh, You just want to, you know, from that hair root, you just want to take some tweezers and just be like, eh. Uh. It just looks like a big hole in the caterpillar. <laughs> yeah, because if he falls, that's it, you know. Oh, damn, right in the eye. What is that come out of his mouth? I mean, it's smoke, but what is it though? Oh! Is he? That is so nasty, like, hmm. But you know, it's just inside of a pimple. You just take that bad boy with some tweezers and get the bitch out. It would be so much better if they get some antibiotics or something. That or, you know, wash your face. Wash your face. <laughs> oh, damn.
Are they? Oh, they're closing it. Oh, that looks so nasty. You know, you, uh, at first it looks nasty on the walls and everything, but then it looks really nasty as a liquid. He fine, you know. He probably chilling with red blood cell. He okay. He probably gonna come up from that. Yep. Mm -hmm. That oh god, he is just covered, and avoided all of this if you just plucked that damn thing what uh, okay whether it's hair maybe like on your face or like like an ingrown hair or maybe your hands I, I mean because like the weirdest thing is I just recently found out a girl has oh, I, and I can't even still believe this but Oh, I was cute. <laughs> He's so adorable, oh my god. But yeah, found out like this girl on TikTok has like an ingrown hair in her finger because she had to do something when she was younger for the doctor and then she hurt herself really bad. And Yeah, I, I was like, wait, what? But yeah, okay, honestly between the two, like, episodes that we had in this one episode I really kind of like the acne one a lot better than the fever one the fever one was funny this uh, also the acne one was funny as well hold on Whew, excuse me sorry it's like one o'clock in the morning and I'm asleep as hell but I'm trying to like work my way through and just stay up and get the sun but to me the acne one was a little more like educational not as much as that because like I, I mean to use the mosquito of course because you know I've always wondered like what is that what what's gonna happen especially you know when a mosquito comes in and, you know bites you and sucks your blood what just happened after that because I've never really like truly asked the doctor or anyone but seeing it and seeing how like literally his like no yeah his nose um looked like a damn knife <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, the acting one was a hell of a lot more interesting. But as I said, all of this could have been prevented if you just got some goddamn tweezers, tweezed that hair out, pulled it out, and, you know, eventually do your skin routine before you go to bed and when you wake up. It's always important because, like, we all get acne whether you are in your teenage age, so, like, 12, of course, because, like, for me, my acne started, like, third grade so I was like nine ten yeah nine ten and I've had acne ever since it, it depends on the person and such some people may get acne for like a couple of years and then after that you know pretty as fuck sometimes we may get it like longer like me or anyone else but it depends on how much you take care of yourself drink a lot of water they say that's a lot of things that will prevent acne later down on the line and you know some people really don't care about that but it's really just important at the end of the day to wash your face 
please and put good things on your face to prevent acne and you know even if you still got it you keep going clean that bad boy because you know you've been walking everywhere you've been outside you never know what the heck is on your face and everything so wash your face ladies and gentlemen it's good good i'm just saying but yeah both both shows were good but like i said i like the acne one a lot more than the first one but other than that guys that is my reaction view tours episode three of season two of cells at work if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next thursday hopefully for episode four bye guys